Hey guys, today I have a collective haul to share with you from the past, like, month, I guess. So first, um, we went to, um, we went hiking, kind of. Well, we went to see a waterfall downstate, and we stopped to eat, and there was a Michael's right next to the restaurant. And since I'm saving up for the, uh, convention or expo or whatever I didn't I only bought one thing and from the rest of this haul video you probably wouldn't think I'm saving but for the convention but I am so I bought some packaging tape with my initial I know right guys out of all things I could I was just amazed by Michael's that was my first time ever so I'll hopefully go back soon it wasn't that far of a drive and then we went to Canada again this year for the busker festival and I went to Paper Memories. It's in Kingston on Princess Street. Um, I bought two things there. I first bought the Easy Mount stuff because I still have those stamps from like pretty sure they're from last year that I've yet to get mounted. So I finally bought some of this and I'll have to look up some tutorials. And then I got some basic gray pirate stickers. I thought these were kind of cute. And they were only two bucks. Because I feel bad when I spend other people's money when I'm in a foreign country. No, I'm just kidding. I just feel bad when I spend my parents' money and such. But I really like this one, so I got that. So that's all I bought there. And then we were at a bookstore in Kingston called Indigo. And they were having a sale. I have the receipt. It's on Princess Street, too. And they were having a sale, and the bookstore has scrapbooking stuff. They had all sorts of stuff. They had an ice cream maker that you could buy. It was just kind of weird. But this was 50% off, so I got this sweet stack for $5. And, um, I'm sure you guys have all seen it, but I'm doing this is a really thick stack. Three sheets of each. So, um, I thought that was a good deal. The other stacks were, they didn't have any, um, mat stacks that I didn't already have in at least a different size. So, I really wanted this one. They didn't have, um, they had 12 by 12 for 50% off, but since you're in Canada, everything's a little more expensive. So, I stuck with the smaller size. And then I went to Big Lots because they had a coupon for one day 20% off everything you bought so I went like a little crazy um, I got these American Crafts stickers for a dollar I thought they were the prettiest purple I've ever seen and that was they came out to be 80 cents I got apparently there's a clearance section in the back of the store that I had no idea existed until I went to Big Lots this time. So I found these stickers, or rub-ons. The Holy Cow rub-ons. I love these ones. I have two other ones, but they're silver, not white. And these were on clearance for 50 cents, so 20% off of that. There's only one sheet. And then I got some more basic gray stuff. A dollar for these um, rub-ons. They're from a collection that is not said. I think these are just, uh, this is one of the really old ones. But I thought these were pretty. And then, um, like the deal of the century, I got this basic gray milk chocolate step chipboard album for three dollars. And then it was also 20% off of that. So it's really pretty. It has like this top note shape, so there's four cover things, and then there's two pages in between all of those. So that's a pretty big mini album, guys. Especially for three dollars, I was just because I've been eyeing that for a few weeks now. And then I got this really pretty and cute ribbon by American Crafts. It was a dollar, and it's um has a little white ruffle on the end, and it's gray in the middle, and it's stretchy. It is the cutest little thing I've ever seen. Like, I just love it. It's three yards for a dollar. So that's what I bought at Big Lots. I also ha 
have one more stop that I have. I went to a yard sale that we saw while we were out going to graduation parties. So we stopped there because they advertised scrapbooking stuff. So I wasn't too happy with the selection, but I could have gotten all the scrapbooking stuff for thirty dollars. But they said someone already came was coming back for it, so I just took the stuff that I really wanted. Well, just the paper anyways. Like, I'm obsessed with buying paper, even though I'm pretty sure I don't need it. Anyway, I got this um, pack of paper for $0.75. Cents. This, they sell this brand at the dollar store, so I knew $0.75 cents was obviously cheap because it's usually a dollar. But I really liked um, this polka dot here. I really like that color. And then... They have the coordinating solids. I got this little pack for 25 cents. There wasn't much in there, but I really like this top one. I thought it was really cute. And then this one, this pack was a dollar, but these are the heavy sheets. And they're obviously from a stack. The way they go together. So I thought those were really cute, and for a dollar, I was like, alright, I'll get it. And then the last stack I got was, is just a bunch of cute little, like this one. This is adorable. I think that one's cute. This one. So, I'm probably done shopping until August, which is when the expo is. And that's it for today, guys. Sorry for the lack of videos and such, because I've been really slacking and stuff, because it's summer. And we've been away a lot and busy, so that's it for today. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.